the Sikh period in the Indian subcontinent, a cultural, political, and religious renaissance introduction. The Sikh period in the Indian subcontinent, spanning from the emergence of Sikhism in the 15th century to the annexation of Punjab by the British in the mid-19th century, marks a significant epoch in the region's history. This period witnessed the rise of a dynamic socio-religious movement, the establishment of a formidable political power, and the flourishing of art, culture, and literature. Emergence of Sikhism Sikhism, founded by Guru Nanak Dev Ji in the early 16th century, emerged as a reformist movement in the socio-religious landscape of medieval India. Guru Nanak preached the ideals of equality, compassion, and devotion to one God, challenging the prevailing social hierarchies and rituals of the time. His teachings laid the foundation for Sikhism, which subsequently evolved under the guidance of nine successive gurus. The Ten Sikh Gurus The Sikh period is characterized by the spiritual leadership of the Ten Sikh Gurus, each contributing to the growth and consolidation of Sikh faith and community. Guru Nanak, the founder, was followed by Guru Angad Dev Ji, who institutionalized the Gurmukhi script and laid the groundwork for the Sikh scripture, Guru Granth Sahib. Subsequent Gurus, including Guru Amar Das, Guru Ram Das, Guru Arjan Dev, and Guru Teg Bahadur, further enriched Sikhism through their teachings, hymns, and sacrifices. Notably, Guru Arjan Dev compiled the Adi Granth, which later became the Guru Granth Sahib, the holy scripture of Sikhism. Formation of Khalsa The transformational phase of Sikhism occurred under the leadership of the 10th Guru, Guru Gobind Singh Ji. In 1699, Guru Gobind Singh inaugurated the Khalsa, a community of initiated Sikhs committed to upholding the principles of righteousness and defending the oppressed. The Khalsa, marked by the five Ks, Kesh, Kirpan, Kara, Kanga, and Kachara, played a pivotal role in shaping Sikh identity and resilience against external oppression. Political Ascendancy the Sikh period witnessed the emergence of Sikh polity as a significant force in the political landscape of the Indian subcontinent. Under the leadership of Maharaja Ranjit Singh, the founder of the Sikh empire in the early 19th century, Punjab witnessed unprecedented political stability, economic prosperity, and territorial expansion. Maharaja Ranjit Singh's secular administration, characterized by religious tolerance and administrative reforms, facilitated the consolidation of Sikh power and influence in the region. Cultural Renaissance The Sikh period was marked by a vibrant cultural renaissance, exemplified by the flourishing of art, architecture, literature, and music. Sikh architecture, epitomized by the Golden Temple in Amritsar, reflected a synthesis of Mughal and indigenous styles. Sikh literature, including the compositions of the gurus and Sikh poets, like Bhai Veer Singh and Guru Gobind Singh Ji, enriched Punjabi literature with profound spiritual and social insights. Sikh music, known as Kirtan, became an integral part of Sikh worship, fostering spiritual elevation and communal harmony. Maharaja Ranjit Singh's reign, spanning from 1799 to 1839, marked a remarkable era in the history of the Indian subcontinent. As the founder of the Sikh Empire, his rule was characterized by military prowess, administrative acumen, and a commitment to religious and cultural harmony. Achievements Military Expansion Maharaja Ranjit Singh's military genius and strategic vision led to the expansion of the Sikh Empire's territories across the northwestern regions of the Indian subcontinent. Through a series of military campaigns, he annexed regions such as Lahore, Multan, Kashmir, and Peshawar, consolidating a vast empire encompassing present-day Punjab, Haryana, Himachal Pradesh, and parts of Pakistan and Jammu and Kashmir. Administrative Reforms Ranjit Singh instituted administrative reforms that promoted efficiency and centralized governance. 
he established a secular administration that integrated officials from diverse religious and ethnic backgrounds, ensuring fair and impartial governance. Cultural Renaissance Under Ranjit Singh's patronage, the Sikh Empire experienced a cultural renaissance with flourishing art, literature, and architecture. He commissioned the construction of several iconic landmarks, including the magnificent Harmandir Sahib, Golden Temple, in Amritsar, and the imposing Lahore Fort. Sikh art and architecture flourished during his reign, blending Mughal and indigenous styles. Conquests Capture of Lahore One of Maharaja Ranjit Singh's most significant conquests was the capture of Lahore in 1799. Lahore, a culturally and strategically important city, became the capital of the Sikh Empire under his rule. The capture of Lahore symbolized the consolidation of Sikh power in the region and laid the foundation for further territorial expansion. Annexation of Kashmir In 1819, Maharaja Ranjit Singh's forces annexed the princely state of Kashmir after defeating its ruler, Raja Fateh Khan. The annexation of Kashmir brought the valley under Sikh control, extending the empire's influence into the Himalayan region. Religious Harmony, Maharaja Ranjit. Singh's reign was characterized by a remarkable degree of religious harmony and tolerance. Despite being a devout Sikh himself, he adopted a policy of religious neutrality and ensured the protection and patronage of all religious communities within his empire. Hindu, Muslim, and Sikh officials served in his administration, and religious institutions received state support irrespective of their faith. Noteworthy Events Treaty of Amritsar In 1809, Maharaja Ranjit Singh signed the Treaty of Amritsar with the British East India Company, establishing a diplomatic relationship between the Sikh Empire and British India. Maharaja Ranjit Singh's death in 1839 marked the end of an era in Sikh history. His empire gradually disintegrated due to internal strife and external pressures from British India and neighboring powers. The succession struggle that followed his death led to the decline of the Sikh Empire and its eventual annexation by the British in 1849. Legacy and Influence The legacy of the Sikh period continues to reverberate in the socio-cultural fabric of the Indian subcontinent. Sikhism, with its emphasis on equality, social justice, and service, continues to inspire millions worldwide. The Sikh diaspora, particularly in countries like Canada, the United Kingdom, and the United States, has contributed significantly to global multiculturalism and interfaith dialogue. Moreover, the political and cultural heritage of the Sikh period remains an integral part of Punjab's identity serving as a source of pride and resilience for its people. Conclusion The reign of Maharaja Ranjit Singh stands as a testament to the resilience, vision, and leadership of one of the most influential figures in Sikh history. Through his achievements, conquests, promotion of religious harmony, and patronage of culture and arts, he left an indelible mark on the Indian subcontinent. Despite the eventual decline of the Sikh empire, Maharaja Ranjit Singh's legacy continues to inspire reverence and admiration among generations of Sikhs and Indians alike. The Sikh period in the Indian subcontinent represents a fascinating chapter in the region's history, characterized by spiritual enlightenment, political ascendancy, and cultural renaissance. From its humble origins as a reformist movement to the zenith of the Sikh empire under Maharaja Ranjit Singh, Sikhism has left an indelible mark on the collective consciousness of the subcontinent. The enduring legacy of the Sikh period serves as a testament to the resilience, diversity, and richness of India's cultural and religious tapestry.